So, my name is Joachim Schönecker. I'm a guitar teacher here at the Conservatory Maastricht and uh, I live in Cologne and I'm here for two days uh, in the week, every week, uh, to teach. The first two years we try to, to uh, give them very much technical information and they also have technical exams at the end of the year so that they um, have a solid foundation on their instrument but also uh, in the, uh, concerning their jazz skills in general. Starting in the third year and in the fourth year um, it, gets, it goes more into an artistic direction. Of course we're still working on, on technical content and on instrumental skills but uh, we try to help them more and more uh, finding their own voice and, and their own music and their own, uh, developing their own vision in music. We are now very lucky to have uh, these uh, two uh, regularly visiting guest teachers, uh, Lage Lund and Peter Bernstein, which come like once or twice a year. And uh, these two guys are um, some of the most outstanding and, and respected players uh, nowadays. So um, the input that uh, they give uh, is, is uh, enormous. I think it's just important for students to, to uh to, like I said, be curious and, and, and explore things. And in my experience, the, the school here and the students have been very um, willing to, to learn and, 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 and uh, curious, which, which makes it an enjoyable teaching experience. Like today, what we did, basically, when we did the group master class, is more or less we just played for a while, you know, and, and, and then just let the students, you know, take it in, in any direction that they wanted in terms of the questions that were things they wanted to talk about, some of which were pretty specific to that playing situation. Others were more, much more open, just like, what, what, what's it like living in New York, you know, like, or who do you like listening to, or... The most essential, well, the most essential thing for them would be the same as the most essential thing for me, I would say, which is, if, if you're gonna do this, the only really good reason to do this is, is the music, you know? So if, you, if you're kind of, if you're a music student and you're kind of like, music is okay, or take it or leave it, then, then I would say, <laughs> probably not for you. But if you have to have it, then it's definitely for you. So my teacher was Joachim Schönecker. He really showed me what I need to do and uh, I always had to work really a lot. So it's, it's an incredible load of work that you have to do, but I, I was just glad to do it. And uh, year after year I, I also saw that I brought myself more in, into the scene, in the scene and in the music and that, I, that it actually worked, what he, what he gave me. And I, like half of what I know is actually uh, from him now especially about jazz, of course. Yeah, and I, I think I got to know really cool people here that I could uh, have bands with, and there are really a lot of projects here, and I got to know great friends, and without them I, I couldn't have realized my music. But I, I managed to play my own music with them, that's really cool. You know, I come from Cologne and I also know how the conservatory there is and um, you know, it's nice about this place that the people are very, very serious there. Um, but here I, I like that uh, you, the guys, the, the students are studying together and it's, it's really about doing this together and I think uh, that's what this school is good at. And uh, for the size, you have to know that Basri is kind of small, right? Uh, for the size, Mustang is really good at doing uh, cultural stuff. You know, I grew up as a student, I consider myself a student, and to be in a room of people who are hungry to learn, to unpack, I guess, all the troubles and issues that we all deal with is really, I don't know, something I cherish greatly. Um, what was interesting to me about today's masterclass was that the students all felt very um, composed and very intelligent. The things they were asking were musical, they were personal, they were physical, they were, they were, it kind of covered the spectrum that I find especially interesting. And to be honest, it's not always that way. Sometimes it's, it's a little more narrow as far as the focus. So I'm leaving here feeling very impressed by everybody and I wish them the best and I'm just, I'm not worried about anybody. I think they'll be fine. So I, I try to get people to think musically. That's uh, 
To me, the most important thing is to, to start thinking musically and not feel, try to get them to, to see, you know, that uh, music is not outside of you, it's within you. It's not on your instrument. And so <clears throat> to turn their attention toward the musician inside them, <laughs> who's waiting to get out, you know, and uh, thinks that um, he has to learn more and learn more and learn more and learn more before he can be a musician. You can be a musician right now, today. And um, so that, that is, you know, I feel like it's something that I learned early, early on that <clears throat> I feel uh, grateful if, if I can pass that along. I sat with you actually two years, yeah, two years, uh, and that was actually also the main reason why I came to to Zelt. I uh, studied before already in The Hague and also a part in Brussels, and uh, I just wanted something else, so I went to to Joachim and. He helped me very well, and we didn't always talk about, you know, the theoretical stuff. But we also talked about just being musical and, and talking about music and listening to music because I think in your master it's it's quite important that you kind of find your direction, that it's you've mastered certain things, and it was a great teacher for me to uh, to really find out what what I want. Now also the jazz guitar department. What I noticed this year is that they had a lot of uh, guitar master classes. That was really also something I noticed. We had almost everybody: Julian Lag, Lagrunt, Peter Bernstein. These are actually all the guys. If you uh, are talking to another jazz guitar player, you will say, "Oh, these are the guys." And they came here and they gave their master classes, and you could have some lessons with them. You could talk to them. You know, that was really something quite uh, remarkable. Well, I think the, this conservatory, uh, a part of being in a very nice city uh, in Holland, uh, is uh, very international. I know that because I teach at many conservatories in Germany um, over the years, and uh, I've never experienced a student group that, that was so international. So that's one of the, of the biggest uh, strengths here. I think they come from everywhere in the world. And I think that the conservatory uh, here is, is uh, offering a very good program. Um, many things here have changed in the last years, and to the better, I think. Many, uh, the, uh, we have many uh, new teachers, also we have uh, a lot of master classes and workshops, tons of, of, of master classes, really uh, outstanding players. Also this I, I never experienced. Uh, this condensed uh, in, in, in Germany in such a short time. Um, and uh, yeah, I think the education is very good and we're constantly working on, on making it better. And um, um, I think one advantage, because it's not such a, such a, such a huge uh, conservatory, is that we have more time and more, more patience to uh, really individually take care of each student. So it's not so anonymous, it's, it's more personal and uh, we try to, to provide the best um, support and, and working atmosphere for every student that we can.